<laughs> Mary, okay, first off, it's crazy that you call me a black expert because I wouldn't take that, right? But today, I guess I'll put that hat on. Anyway, you may have seen these little creatures appearing in your backyard or in the trees. They are cicadas and have been emerging all over the St. Louis area. You guys want to take a look. They're noisy. It can be quite loud, I think, um, about the level of like a motorcycle or a lawnmower. Odd looking. They've got striking orange wings with a very noticeable black body. And returning back to Earth after years of hiding underground. We get cicadas that come out of the ground every single year here in St. Louis, but this year we are getting the periodical cicadas that come out of the ground every 13 years. Underground, they live primarily on the juices of tree roots. And when the time is right, they start to sprout. So I think the theory is that they kind of track the number of temperature cycles. And once the ground hits 64 degrees for the 17th time, they will come out of the ground. It's a phenomenon that many are excited for. Am I excited for the cicadas? Yeah, and also a little bit terrified. I'm terrified, but I'm excited for my son because he loves bugs. And others, not so much. I'm not really looking forward to any bugs that come with the <laughs> summer. <laughs> Oh, and I forgot to mention the crowd that uh, are ready to just buzz around with them. Because they're like, <laughs> <laughs> no. What's going on? <laughs> now, one question I often got was, what's the benefit of the cicadas even coming at all? These cicadas will be an injection of food and resources into the food chain, but that means more baby birds, more baby mammals next year. It's really something that benefits all living things in the ecosystem. You can expect millions of periodical cicadas to emerge, so check your trees, your shrubs, and remember... And they don't bite or sting or anything like that. They're not poisonous or dangerous. The biggest problem is that there's just going to be lots of them, and for a few weeks, we'll just have to cohabitate with yeah. them. Wow. Ooh, <laughs> Um, so I know the, the whole thing has been people hearing them, yeah. but I have not heard them yet. And I don't know if it's because we're downtown or... I've you heard know, them. I've heard it. I, I think. I remember <laughs> when they came years ago when I was a kid. Yeah. And it was so loud. Like, you yeah. couldn't walk outside without just, like, it was so overwhelming. So I'm, like, waiting for that part right. of the season to come. But right now, I'm just seeing them, like, on the ground when I walk with yes. my dogs. Well, you know, so it's I, funny. I see them here and there. At the beginning of the package here, uh, what's the saying? He, he was talking about how uh, the noise yeah. compares to like a Harley a Davidson. Yeah. Or, See, you, know, you say stadium. that, and, then and I'm I haven't thinking, heard it. Maybe I haven't heard them. That's what I'm like. Because I, have I not even heard here the in the studio this noise. I think it's a light, but I'm thinking, is that a cicada? It could be a cicada. <laughs> we might have a box of cicadas in here. Yeah, I wouldn't oh, let know. Let me go and grab. No. Oh no, no. no. <laughs> and with you, I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> no. One no. time, no. Leek had crickets. Oh, oh, wow, it's exposing me here. I in had to think. This so is a I, true I keep, story. I, we I keep thought it was a mouse. I keep <laughs> reptiles, and I had to go to the store before I went home, and it was close to the end of the day, and so... <laughs> On the way home, I had to get some crickets and uh, walk the way back to the office. St. Louis group text is blowing up. Like, um, there's Blake, there's there's some some crickets in the office. Oh my gosh! Well, it was crickets, no cicadas, no yeah, cicadas. Yeah, let's just no not, cicadas. don't bring. Cicadas. Yeah, so it'll be a motorcycle. But he's and he's trying to get office. us to eat one, so he knows. So it's coming you guys soon. stay tuned because I'm going to get you guys to eat one. Mm, and absolutely. all of my friends at home watching because I'm trying to encourage every everyone's so afraid. It's a once in a lifetime thing. Well, once in every 13-year thing. Once in 13 years. So we'll give it another 13. There's no rush. <laughs>